One reason why I regret leaving Islam is that I have officially lost the opportunity to have my own beautiful, exciting virgins in heaven, for example, with big eyes, beautiful boobs, untouched, pure virgins that serve me, that I can have sex with whenever I want, for all eternity, a gift promised by the great Allah to every true believing man. Because Allah knows what's best for every man and what every man wants, what every man needs. This is one of the more reasonable aspects of Islam that I can fully relate to. Of course, I'm just kidding. I'm not an animal. You know, in Islam, you are promised sexy women in heaven who are there for your pleasure, beautiful women, satisfying you while you are reclining on your throne and drinking wine from rivers of wine. So stupid. There is no way to deny this because it sounds so ridiculous, so idiotic, so primitive. Many modern pop Muslims today try to make this go away and reinterpret it, claiming some very absurd stuff like that the Quran was actually describing root in heaven. But the Quran is very clear on these virgins and Muhammad describes further that men will receive beautiful women that are like nothing else. Attractive women with beautiful breasts, skin so soft and white that you can almost see their bones. And they are shy as strong 7th century men liked them. A fantasy that men had in a very primitive culture, such as 7th century Arabia or other cultures that were so uneducated that the only thing they could think of, the only thing that could, they could glorify were basic human functions and their perversion, where the human intellect had not developed to a remotely sophisticated level and shape and could therefore not contribute to humanity. Sadly, Islam is the embodiment of all that. I'm talking about this because I want people to understand what growing up in such a messed up mindset with such a terrible belief does to people. Of course it teaches men to objectify women and to view them as inferiors who should, who have to satisfy the sexual needs of men. Is it a surprise that so many Muslim men so often have such terrible attitudes toward women? That the Islamic world sucks when it comes to women? It's I am the Prophet Muhammad. I was born in the year 570 in Mecca. I saw this angel in the desert. It was Gabriel. Yes, it was. <laughs> 